Morning. Steamed up. <laughs> Just put these glasses on and they've steamed up. Uh, oh, got no room. Okay, all right, check it out. So it's the next day, that is feeling creamy and smooth, as is that, beautiful job. Nice, nice, nice. So, today I'm gonna put those on there, well, flip that over, um, and attach them, and then put the hard coat on, and then the table is completed. Uh, so yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Uh, Lola is out there, she is just destroying everything at the moment. You leave her for two minutes and she's just wrecking everything. Um, it's all right, it's a phase that they go through, but uh, you know, whatever. Um, also, you can't see it, but it's there. Uh, my GoPro, the SD card, won't click in. So I've wedged a bit of wood in the side. Uh, and uh, that's <laughs> sufficing. Um, if anybody's got an old GoPro, this is a Hero 4, so it's like, I don't know, 10 years old or something. Uh, if anybody's got an old GoPro that you just don't use and you wanna sort of, you know, donate it, then <laughs> drop me a, um, a message. Slide into my DMs, I think the young people say, although that's not what's going on here, but anyway. Enough waffle, let's crack on. All right. Goes there, I've got to position it right, haven't I? That's over three. What's this one? Yeah. That's dead on three. That's dead on three. <laughs> Is there a better way of doing this? It's just over three. It's just under three. Yeah, don't. Oh, Lola moved it. Oh, Lola. <laughs> no. Oh, you bugger. Ah, oh, you absolute swine. <laughs> oh. It's getting close then. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Oh. 
Okay. One trip to screw fix later. Corner braces, packs of 10. I thought I'd buy a bunch, only a pound 50. I can't open them. I have a tool. That block is changing. La 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 la, there they are. So let's, uh, there we are. So I am going to pre-drill the holes. All right, so they're going to go sit like this, aren't they? job. So shall I set do a set length do you think? Set length from the edge. Do we care? <laughs> yeah. Something like that isn't it? Three inches. on hammer. get one in position you know I mean, that's not going to go through is it no but it's close just take out some of the meat
try and lift this thing. Uh, put it down. There we go. Oh, it's heavy and I've got a bad rib. table sturdy as now all that's left to do is these bad boys N3, hard coat and top coat. What is it, top coat and hard coat? <laughs> Can't remember, but that's what we'll do next. Okay. <clears throat> so, first bit is the hard coat. Give it a good shake, wet your pad. Now, I have used this pad before. And your man from um, Blacktail Studio says, do not ever use it before. Then he's dealing in very glossy finishes. And I've rubbed this and that feels absolutely smooth to me. So I'm gonna do it. I don't care what he says, I'm gonna do it. I'm not using the, one of these every time I just do that. So yeah, now, <clears throat> um, let's pop that to one side. So soak your pad. Well, that's smelly. And you make a well and you draw it up. Now I can already see it's made an improvement. However, I think I need much more than that. side now. I am going down the sides. Continue to work it. For a small table like this, I'm doing the whole thing in one go. He says, the man, Cam, give yourself 90 seconds, but that's in hot conditions. So this is very cold today, so I think I've got more time. it off just the weight of your hand don't want to buff off too much what you don't want is shiny streaks okay That'll do for the first coat, I believe. Okay, so it's been two or three minutes, five minutes maybe. It's totally flashed off, as he says, even in these cold conditions. So I'm gonna do coat number two. And Cam says, do at least two coats. He's gonna, he does three on his super high-end tables, but for my little thing here, 
two will be plenty. Right up to the corners, across the grain, with the grain. seconds and buff it off all right that's it for the hard coat to go on will be the top coat which is the final I always find these difficult there you go the final sort of waterproofing layer I think we only need one of these okay so we are 24 hours bit less than 24 hours after applying two coats of the hard coat I, yeah hard coat I don't know you sort of think oh why is it called the hard coat I still feel like I could dig my fingernail into it do you know what I mean but um and this is the pad I use and that's really soft I was expecting that to go crusty it really hasn't Cam in Blacktail Studios, he says this will go, this will dry rock hard. It hasn't. Do you think maybe this is snake oil? Um, anyway, so now you just put on one coat of top coat, and this is really the stuff that makes the water bead up. Stuff like that. So, oh, I've got a bit of a bad back. Like that. That's the little bit of a clear epoxy, so you can actually see into there. It's quite nice. Okay, so this is. Yeah, dust free. Give this a good shake. I mean, it just looks like water. It certainly doesn't smell like water, so I know there is some active ingredient in there. So. Come on, there you come. Plenty on there. smells so I know it's something and then we go yeah, already <laughs> feels tacky let's put a bit more on I don't know why that's feeling tacky. I'm just going to buff that off.
Okay. Gonna give it a few seconds to flash off, as they say. And then give it a buffet. Just take off any excess. There we have it. One finished table. I think it looks good. It's kind of a silk finish on the top but there we go so um, that's the coffee table done uh, if you have been watching this series I'd like to thank you very much um, I don't have a lot of time to do lots of fancy editing and tricks like that if there's anybody out there that wants to practice their editing and edit these things for me and make them good that would be really good um, but hopefully you find it interesting and hopefully you've noticed an improvement in my skills I think this is the nicest piece I've done so far. Certainly from an accuracy point of view it's my best. It's not perfect. I could I could point out I could point out problems. Like there's a little gap there, a little tiny gap there. You know, I could go around and point out imperfections, but I think you know that's pretty good. Um so we continue the journey. I've got some ideas for what I'm gonna do next, but if anybody would like a table or something then drop me a slide into my DMs something like that um, but yeah I'll leave you with the table mm -hmm.